my one abiding passion is recently that there's been an explosion in Indian publishing and in writing from India what there isn't is any critical scale by which to judge anything. Years ago I was asked by our journalists what's the one thing you learnt in Cambridge? Can you sum it up in one sentence? And I said I learnt that one poem is better than another. And if you're lost in a sea of writing you don't know what's literature and what's seaweed. So you have to see what's living in that sea and you need a school of criticism to tell you that uh, Vikram Set is possibly better than Shobade or that Shobade is possibly better than Vikram Set and why, right? That's what I want to know and I want somebody to give me that kind of guide. I could perhaps do it myself. I think the literature courses have become obsessed with uh, semantics and American and French rubbish. So what they don't say is why is a poem good, why is a poem not so good, right? And what I find is even amongst accomplished writers, they mix their metaphors, uh, you know, they talk nonsense. I heard one fellow saying yesterday on the platform, like a tea bag, I began to absorb everything I was dipped in. Tea bags don't do that. Tea bags give out the flavor of tea. They don't absorb everything that you're dipped in.